Welcome back to Sports News Now. Here's Olumide Makoli. Thank you, Ijoma. Hello and welcome to Sports News. Quarterfinalists have emerged at the Season 11 of the Channel's International Kids Cup after three days of group action. 19 goals were recorded with Zamfir School, Lagos, Holy Savior from Oshu and Banham Model from River State reaching the last eight. All right, welcome back. Uh, it is the second half for all for the game between Oyo and Oshun State. Uh, in Group A, with Kwaras Adetunji Primary one. School already in the last eight, there's just one ticket available. Yeah. It's uh, been a very, very uh, wonderful three days. A long goal by Lawal Olumide against Oyo St. Williams Primary School was good enough to steal a quarterfinal place for Holy Savior from Oshun State. In the next stage of the competition, and that's why victory is very key. Lovely play, lovely play. And uh, that is uh, the first uh, goal of uh, this encounter. Kripi was also tight. Model primary school from Bayelsa, Ikhawere from Edo, and Sampra School Lagos played for a place in the quarterfinal. With five points each, Edo and Lagos advanced. He's able to coolly claim that. That's a deep clearance, and the goalkeeper misjudges the bounce of the ball. And it is the second goal of the game for Edo, and a very jubilant coach on the touchline. By that striker from San Fran, and the ball is crossed in yet again. Can they make this count? He tries to hit the ball, and the ball goes into the back of the net. Finally, they force the issue. They get the equalizer, and you can see the jubilation, the ecstasy. We are in the last day of the preliminary rounds, and the match you're about to witness is the match between Delta State and uh, their opponents from Eboin. The Sierra Primary School from Delta State produced a good display to pick the available slot in Group D. In number nine jersey, as uh, he tries to turn and he gets the goal. Delta looking good, but uh, still on two goals that they scored in the first half. Good dribble. And for once, we are seeing maximum use of space. And what a lovely goal from that Delta dashing winger. And it's a We're now, now in the team. business stage of the competition. So a good the action goal goal will get tougher as the A team will be hoping Brilliant to lift finish. the trophy. Brilliant finish from that number seven player from AKT, uh, Olaleko Olatunji. Oh. A former primary uh, municipal school from Ghana will face Adesunji Primary School from Ilori in Kwara State in the quarterfinals of the Channels International's Kids Cup Season 11. In the other quarterfinal pairings, Banham Model School from Port Harcourt River State will battle Holy Savior Primary School from Washun. Iguawere Primary School, Edo State, will square up against Ecoville Port Harcourt, uh, sorry, Port Novo from Benna Republic, while Nosia Primary School from Agbo in Delta State will confront Samfra Primary School from Ibutemeta in Lagos. All the games will be played tomorrow at the Agege Stadium in Lagos. FIFA President Gianni Infantino has commended Russia for hosting the highest global cup ever as President Vladimir Putin introduced him with a state award for his position in making remaining 12 months of the event imaginable. Uh, Infantino, who has the Order of Friendship medal pinned to his lapel, said the bonds of friendship created with Russia will remain endless. Russia's successful 2010 bid to host the 2018 event, which FIFA oversaw below Infantino's discredited predecessor, Sepp Platter, was once marred by way of allegations of corruption within the bidding process. In 2014, FIFA cleared Rush the Russian government of wrongdoing even though Western critics persisted with within the run-up to the event to query its protection credentials and counsel it will play into putting its palms politically. Arsenal and Chelsea have sent back 6,000 unsold tickets for the Europa League final to UEFA. The governing body is facing the embarrassment of large sections of the Olympic Stadium in Baku being empty for the final next Wednesday. Supporters from both London-based clubs are reluctant to make the 5,000-mile round trip to the Azerbaijan capital. The Gunners have sold more than 3,000 tickets and a further 500 have been purchased by fans from around the world, but Chelsea have fared worse. The news comes after Arsenal midfielder Henrik Mkhitaryan's decision to miss the final after expressing fear over his safety owing to the political tension between the players' homeland, Armenia, and Azerbaijan. 
Host Portugal have named their squad for next month's inaugural Nations League final with Cristiano Ronaldo heading the bill and an inclusion for Benfica teenager Yao Felix. Portugal will kick off the new competition with a semi-final against Switzerland in Porto on June the 5th with the winners playing either England or the Netherlands in the final at the same venue four days later. Ronaldo was included as expected, having returned to the squad after missing several matches last year, following an agreement with the coach, Fernando Santos. And that's it on Sports News. Ijoma is back with the rest of the news at 10. Thanks a lot, Ulumide. And the main news again. Nigeria Police Council today confirmed Mohamed Adamu as Substantive Inspector General of Police. He becomes the 20th Indigenous Inspector General of Police. Also today, presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, Atiku Abubakar, raised alarm over alleged plan to cause crisis in some parts of the country and accused him of being responsible. And Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi has been re-elected for another five years in office following landslide victory in the general elections. And that's the news at 10 tonight. Thanks so much for staying with us. I'm Ujoma Honyato. Do have a good night. Thank you.